Don't forget to check out and grab your copy of our two newly released books, Football, A Love Story, and What Did Football Teach Me? These books feature over 100 stories from current and former coaches, players, executives, and entertainers from across the football landscape describing what got them involved in a game, what they love about it, and what life lessons the game taught them. You can find your copy or order your copy from our website at footballgameplan.com slash books. Welcome to footballgameplan.com, where football makes sense. I'm your host, Teron Davenport, and we are here with defensive back Maurice Kennedy. Yes, Maurice, coming into this week, I mean, you're a guy that, that you know, bigger mm-hmm. corner. Talk about what you wanted to show as far as movement and your ability to cover as a bigger corner. Like you said, um, you know, I'm bigger than, you know, most corners. So I really, want, you know, want to perform, you know, showing my, you know, my physicality, you know, showing that I improved on my technique over the offseason. And um, really, you know, just compete, man. Now, one of the things that I see you lining up outside, I see you bumping inside, playing the slot. I even saw you play a little linebacker in situations. So. Did. What is it that allows you to be so versatile on, on the football field? Um, really, you know, I never played defense until, you know, I got to college. So, you know, it's just, it's just you know, natural, you know, the athleticism, you know, shows. And, um, yeah, I'm just trying to be the best I can be. Tell me how we was competing at that day. <laughs> You know, from different school, man, that's there you go. a different mentality, see? man, when you're going, going against the best and the best. Man. The, the, yeah, the yeah. one-on-one, see, there, there, there you have it. That's one of the things you get here at the Senior Bowl. Yeah, right you get competition go, right between here, competition the two, football. you know what I'm saying? So yeah. <laughs> just to keep it rolling with, with Maurice Kennedy, as far as your ability to help out in the return game, how much does that add to your value as a prospect? Mm-hmm. Um, you know, it's funny, you know, I've been telling my coaches all, you know, my, my whole career that, you know, if I get back there, you know, I take a couple to the crib for you. So uh, they finally gave me an opportunity my senior year, and um, I averaged about 25 yards um, of return. So I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure it adds to my value. As a longer corner, obviously you want to be disruptive at the line of scrimmage, especially while well, both playing the, in the slot and outside. No question, no question. How does your ability to press, I mean, take me through the – the whole process going against a, a receiver at the line of scrimmage and disrupting the timing yeah, of the passing yeah. game. Especially, you know, with the, the smaller, shorter guys in the slot, you know, you really you really have to, you know, make them go where you want them to go. You got to know where your help is, and, you know, it's a whole lot of field in the slot. So, and, you know, the quick and, you know, small, quick, fast guys, you know, you really you really have to get your hands on them. If not, you know, it's going to be a long day for you. And um, my, my long arms really help, you know, and, um, yeah, you just got to compete, man. You just got to want to win every play. What would you say if you if you had to pick some of the the, the, the routes that that you feel you could improve in covering? Are there any particular routes? Um, yeah, of course. You know, every every outside cornerback, you know, they they hate the slugger route because you know you get sometimes you get caught in a bind. Like when you want to break, you know, you always want to make a big play. You want to break on the slant, but it's how you break. It's it's where you break, and you know you gotta watch your eyes. So sometimes you want to make contact. Sometimes you want to turn open and run. So yeah, my coach. Um, my coach, you know, that's coaching me here from Dallas Cowboys, she's really doing a great job and, you know, showing me, you know, where, where my key is for my eyes. Yeah, speaking of your eyes and the key, you know, a lot of times as a defensive back, you got to keep one eye on the receiver and another on the quarterback. How are you able to balance your vision and be able to stay with your man yeah. while watching the quarterback? Yeah, it really is. It, it depends on the coverage. You know, if, we, if we're in a, some type of zone coverage, you know, you really you really want to you, you want to feel him more than you want to look at him. Mm-hmm. Versus man, you know, you really want to key that receiver. So, um, man. And, it, and before the ball is snapped, you know, you want to look at the um, quarterback to read three steps. So, yeah, it's really been working out for him. Obviously, we had one of the receivers come in and, you know, talk about the competition. I want to give you an opportunity to talk about the competition that, that you're going against. How do you feel you measure up against yeah. these guys? Yeah. I mean, um, coming in, you know, I wasn't, you know, a lot of people, you know, really didn't know me. You know, I, I, I kind of like it. You know, I like it a lot because, you know, you you gonna have to you know show me that you you can beat me. I mean, I, like you said, it's the best on the best. So um, yeah, I'm I'm just grateful that I'm in this opportunity. You know, show that I can compete. There you have it, Virginia defensive back Maurice Kennedy. We appreciate you taking the I appreciate time. You. I appreciate All right. You.